It is Friends Festival time here in Ottawa, and with over 50 shows to choose from, we're here to answer one question. Should you see it? It's set in South, South London, and um, there's this, the Avalon party, which is headed by this Mr. Avalon. And he's, it's this radical right-wing party, which is based off the British National Party in England. His stepson, Curtis, has been seeing visions of his dead, of his dead brother and wants to have a seance and bring his brother's ghost. The first thing you'll notice about Moonfleece is that the cast is young. Moon Fleece was put together by the senior acting class of the Ottawa School of Speech and Drama, making the cast of the play all somewhere between 15 and 18 years old. Moon Fleece is a complex play set in South London and dealing with issues of politics, racial supremacy, and homosexuality that actually got it banned in Dudley in the United Kingdom. One of the main characters is stepson to the leader of the Nationalist Party, who is being haunted by the ghost of his dead brother and wants to get to the bottom of the mystery of his death. With the exception of one or two lesser characters that come across as lackluster, the cast did an exceptional job. Particularly, Anit Ramon and Vanessa Anstead. Far more than you'd expect from a group so young. The complaint for Moonfleece is directorial, more than anything. The cast didn't use South London accents, which was a good choice, since there's no better way to kill a performance than with poor or inconsistent accents. The problem is that words like oi and bloody whatever sound really out of place without the accent to accompany them. It was an easily avoidable distraction from an otherwise strong performance. The other great thing about the play was that they took full advantage of having a venue to themselves and set up what was a more elaborate standing set than you usually see at Fringe. We can expect great things from these actors in the future and Moonfleece is an impressive yay. Come and join us on our website shouldyouseeit.com. Give us your take, join the discussion and watch more of our reviews. You can also follow us on Twitter at yayornayreviews to find out what shows we're seeing next.